So I have just arrived at our destination for next week's episode. But for this week, I think I need to start things off by apologizing. An apology because this week's episode hasn't gone exactly to plan. because that plan was to be here last week, but unfortunately, bad weather yet again meant that those plans were changed significantly. So everything is out. We've had a bit of a disaster yet again, but I'm gonna use the time to explain to you quite a lot of things that have gone on in the last few weeks behind the scenes that I think you might want updating on. And that update includes where we are at now filming for next week's episode but maybe more importantly some updates on sponsors have been some real interesting news and plenty of work going on behind the scenes which I hope to have a significant update for you very shortly the course i am looking at behind the camera right now is absolutely stunning it's going to feature like i said in next week's episode but we'll also have a well, let's say a guest on the channel but someone you haven't seen before so some new faces on camera so that green behind me is a bit of a clue as to where we are many will guessed already from the hotel itself but that was the 16th green one of the funkiest greens i've ever seen in my life and uh, can't wait to get there i'm not playing golf until tomorrow but the challenges we face on this channel are twofold in the main right now at least anyway and that's the weather we chose to start this series and this filming in the winter months which perhaps wasn't the best idea but we've really been trying to get a weekly episode and commit to every Monday putting something out so we've tried our best last week some horrendous storms in the UK which meant this whole thing was cancelled and there was just absolutely nothing we can do about that and the second thing is finance which I've talked to you about a lot and the need to get sponsors in to help finance these projects and make it happen so that's what we've been working hard to do and I'm glad to say, although I can't reveal kind of who right yet, but there's been some massive progress. And really the interesting bit was the minute I put the video out that suggested we needed sponsorship, we got no end of response from brands who wanted to get involved in this project. Now, let's be honest, the only reason they want to get involved is because they've seen how successful it's been and how it's how you've responded to it so this is a first thank you really because if you don't get involved in the comment section the likes the views obviously themselves then it means nothing to them they're only interested in the numbers and because it's been so successful then uh, we've got some real real support potential at least anyway that hopefully i can announce very very shortly but it looks at least like we're going to be carrying this on for quite some time and we've now started planning our travel for the next few months up until May and uh, it's all around the UK and Ireland but there's some real exciting places to visit. Now the other thing I thought we'd have a quick chat about is the staying in the van because one of the main intentions of when we started this channel was to very much take it on the road, sleeping it, cooking it, living it. And that's again been a bit of a challenge because of the winter months to say the least it's been a little bit chilly and we'll definitely get to that in the warmer summer months the other issue we've had is that since we've put these videos out we've had no end of uh, hotels quite nice ones as well asking us to come and stay and include their accommodation into our content and to be quite honest with you that's hard to turn down as much as it may disappoint some of you now has anyone managed to guess where we are yet for next week's episode i think there's been a fair few giveaways to be fair obsessed with coffee and little coffee makers and that's a mini espresso maker for two as in a little mocha how cool is that 
The other problem we've got today is this was a uh, last minute plan in terms of putting this together. So we're gonna have to find somewhere to quickly edit. And that looks like being a coster. All I can see is I'm glad we're filming tomorrow and not today because it's pouring down out there now and the forecast for tomorrow morning is bright sunshine and last week by the way was 60 mile an hour winds and that is a challenge to say the least to filming but also the golf courses don't want us there either because the places don't look too great. I just want to go back to the beginning I said we had a special guest coming back to the channel and that's Lewis Johnson. Now many of you have seen Lewis in the past if you've been watching the channel for a while basically he's a PGA professional golfer and in the next couple of episodes we'll take on uh, more of a golfing challenge so playing 18 holes and attempting to break some kind of scoring effort so it'll be a different slant on what we've been doing so far see how you take those on board and I'll be judged by the feedback what you think of them and whether we continue to do more of those or not but Lewis has always been popular on the channel so hopefully many of you will be glad to see him back and then I said about the support and the views and everything else that you've done to make sure that we've got the potential to get sponsors on board. We introduced the sort of photo of the week competition which has been hugely popular. And lots of you get involved by voting on, it's usually a Tracy or an Andy, and it generally is Tracy that takes the win. And that is massively important to us because you being involved in the comments just helps the whole YouTube algorithm. I've no idea how it all works, but all I can tell you is the more you get involved, the more comments we get, the more likes we get, the more general interaction, the longer you watch for, all these things help in promoting our video so more and more people get to watch it. So, like I said, it was a, this one has been made very much on the hoof. We decided we didn't have a video that was gonna go out this evening. It is now Monday afternoon at about 4.30. We will have this video out by 6.30, so it's very much a rushed effort. But I just didn't wanna skip a week. I said earlier on in the videos that I'd found a new way to communicate with the audience again. So it seemed like an opportunity just to have a one-on-one -on -one chat, give you a bit of a update as to what's happened. I think only thing, the only other thing I want to mention is the travel plans are very much right the way through to May. And one of the big trips we've got coming up in May will be over to Ireland, which I can't wait. And there's a few more visits up to Scotland. It's uh, some exciting stuff ahead. And hopefully, like I said, in the next few weeks, I'll be able to announce a big change in the sponsorship, which should mean we've got some security in planning this for the rest of the year. Right, so the final message is just thank you for watching, thank you for supporting. Even if you can like and comment in some way on this video, it'd be greatly appreciated. There's no photo of the week, I'm afraid, but everything will resume back to normal next week. And the course that I'm looking out at right now is an absolute belter and I can't wait to share it with you. Right, thanks for watching, see you next week.